students we are going to continue exercise 8.4 in our previous lecture we had done first three parts of question number 5 today we are going to start part fourth look at screen question is there on the board 1 plus secant a upon secant a equals sin square a over 1 minus cos a what we are going to do let us solve left hand side 1 plus secant a can be written as 1 by cos a right and in denominator as well we are having secant a that can be written as 1 by cos a right so let's move ahead cos a can be taken lcm in numerator and this cos a will be multiplied with 1 we will get cos a plus 1 and in denominator we are having 1 by cos a already this cos a and this cos a will be cancelled and we will get cos a plus 1 so that is what answer of my left hand side is let us solve right hand side now see we are having sin square a in our numerator i am going to use this formula sin square a plus cos square a is equal to 1 from here value of sin square a will come out to be 1 minus cos square a so i am using this form value now instead of sin square a i am going to write 1 minus cos square a denominator is already 1 minus cos a now this one this one i can write it as one square it becomes a square minus b square that means a plus b a minus b and in denominator 1 minus cos a right so this 1 minus cos a and 1 minus cos a cancelled we get 1 plus cos a see left side was cos a plus 1 it is 1 plus cos a both are same i can still write it as cos a plus 1 right so therefore left side is equal to right sides hence proved so it is very easy question the only thing which we need to take care in my right side sin and cos are there so my left side should be converted to sin and cos so how i tried i put secant a is equal to 1 by cos a right so let's move to next part look at the statement cos a minus sin a plus 1 over cos a plus sin a minus 1 equals cosecant a plus cotangent a now see my right side is having cosecant and cotangent whereas my left side is having sin and cos so let us start from left hand side and let's see which trick i'm going to use dividing numerator and denominator both by sin a we get now let's see what are we are going to get from here cos is divided by sin see i am going to divide each and every term now with sin cos by sin a sin a over sin a 1 upon sin a cos a upon sin a sin a over sin a minus 1 upon sin c numerator and denominator everything is divided by sin a so let's see what we get cos upon sin is cotangent sin upon sin this will be cancelled we will get 1 1 by sin a is cosecant a then cos upon sin cotangent sin upon sin cancelled we get 1 then 1 by sin a is cosecant a so see what we have done we have converted my left side 
each and every value into cot or cosecant which is desired in my right hand side right let's see now what next step now see the next step is cot a plus this plus cosecant a i'm going to write then i'm going to write minus 1 i've changed its position upon cot a plus 1 minus cosecant a as it is okay now see this cot a plus cosecant a i'm writing it as it is minus now this one here i'm going to use this identity 1 plus cot square a is equal to cosecant square a this identity i'm going to use and i'm going to find value of 1 from this identity how will i find this cot square a will move to right right side and i'll get cosecant square a minus cot square a going to write it in bracket instead of 1 i have put this value and denominator as it is this is the main step of this question now what next cot a plus cosecant a can i write it as like this cosecant a plus cot a just interchanging their positions minus it is a square minus b square so formula is making cosecant a plus cot a that means a plus b and a minus b so this is the formula which is being built here and still denominator remain as it is cot a plus 1 minus cosecant a i hope you are clear till now i have to clean the board from this side let's have a look what next step we need to do see this is cosecant plus cot a this is cosecant plus cot a cosecant plus cot a cosecant a plus cot a it can be taken out common from these both terms instead of all this i can write only one because it is already taken out common then this minus sign i'm writing as it is this bracket is already out remaining is cosecant a minus cot a so i'm going to write this cosecant a minus cot a right so this is what my numerator has become and denominator there is no change cot a plus 1 minus cosecant a as it is see now we are almost reached to our answer this bracket as it is cosecant a plus cotangent a right so i'm going to clean the whole board now let's continue doing this step cosecant a plus cot a as it is and now open this bracket inside 1 minus cosecant a then minus minus plus cot a now let's check the denominator <coughs> this one i'm writing at now first number at second number i am writing minus cosecant a and this cotangent a i am writing at third number why i have done it see these both terms are same 1 minus cosecant a plus cotangent a 1 minus cosecant a plus cotangent a say all these are cancelled and we get cosecant a plus cotangent a and this is my right side i wanted to prove it so this question was a bit tricky first one was dividing numerator and denominator by sin a and second trick which came in between was putting the value of 1 using this formula 1 plus cot square a is equal to cosecant square a. i hope you are clear with this question let's move to next part look at the question root 1 plus sin a over 1 minus 
साइन ए इज इक्वल टू सी कैंट ए प्लस टेन जेंट ए वी नीड टू प्रूव इट लुकिंग एट स्केयर रूट डोंट जस्ट गेट अ फ्रेड दिस इज वेरी ईजी क्वेश्चन टेक लेफ्ट साइड एंड सी वन प्लस साइन ए ओवर वन माइनस साइन ए वी आर हैविंग वट वी आर गोइंग टू डू वी आर गोइंग टू जस्ट रैशनलाइज दिस इज वन माइनस साइन ए लेट मी मल्टीप्लाई विद वन प्लस साइन ए एंड डिवाइड विद वन प्लस साइन ए वेरी इजी क्वेश्चन दीज टू विल बी मल्टीप्लाइड विद ईच अदर बोथ आर सेम वैल्यूज सो इट कैन बी रिटर्न एज वन प्लस साइन ए होल स्केयर एंड इन डिनोमिनेटर ए माइनस बी ए प्लस बी दैट मीन्स ए स्केयर माइनस बी स्केयर राइट सो नेक्स्ट स्टेप न्यूमिनेटर लेट मी राइट इट एज इट इज वन प्लस साइन ए स्केयर वन माइनस साइन स्केयर ए दिस फॉर्मूला वी हैव डन साइन स्केयर ए प्लस को स्केयर ए इज इक्वल टू वन right so 1 minus sin square a when this sin square a will move to this side we will get only cos square a so i am writing cos square a now see this is also square this is also square square root can be removed we will get 1 plus sin a over cos a right our next step 1 upon cos a plus this sin a upon cos a वन बाय कोस ए कैन बी रिटर्न एज सी कैंट ए साइन बाय कोस कैन बी रिटर्न एज टेन जेंट ए सो दिस इज वट वी वॉन्टेड टू प्रूव सो इन अवर टूडेज लेक्चर वी हैव कवर्ड नेक्स्ट थ्री पार्ट्स फोर्थ फिफ्थ एंड सिक्स आई होप यू आर क्लियर विद ऑल द कंसेप्ट यूज इन दीज पार्ट्स इन अवर नेक्स्ट लेक्चर वी विल कॉन्टिन्यू सेवंथ पार्ट थैंक यू सो मच